Hello everyone, this is Inglorious P back in our video today. And today I'm going to show you all my mail day as well as the cards I just picked up from the Dallas Card Show today, this Friday. Um, <clears throat> before I begin, please like, comment, subscribe, and let me know what you guys think of this video, what you want to see in future videos, all that good stuff. And let's hop into it. Um, I'm sorry for the delay in videos. I got super busy this week. Um, so that's why I'm only posting today and I wasn't posting the uh, past couple days. Um, I'm hoping in the future to post videos about dibs and my successes and failures on that one. So let's hop into it. Here is the mail day. So really this first stack, we'll kind of save that one. This is just, um, I paid $36 to get all of these hoops cards. Um, just prospects I like. I got a couple... Um, Got a couple silvers in here. Sorry, my phone uh, just had an issue. Um, silver Kevin Porter. Got more Basil, Salmonage. Got Purple Disco, Purple Disco Salmonage, Green, Purple Claxton, Alani Walker throwing in a Salmonage. So I think it's going to end up, I think, let me count them out again. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five. So a little over a dollar each. Not bad for that. Um, and also got this number to twenty-five. Kevin Porter Jr. encased uh, BGS nine. It's got on card auto. Um, for it was like a hundred bucks, hundred twenty. No, it was one hundred twenty-five bucks. Bought on eBay. Um, not bad. Out of twenty-five, I'm telling you, I like them a lot. Um, I'm gonna see if I could flip this at the Dallas Card Show. Maybe not. I'll hold on to it. Um, a comparable to this, John Morant's is like five hundred bucks. So I see a lot of upside on that. So what you're here for though is the Dallas Card Show pickup. So let me show you guys what I got. Um, and I will say this: the Dallas Card Show. Is the closest thing you're gonna to get to the nationals so many vendors um, so many choices um, be patient um, I did notice this time there's a lot more individual sellers this time around than last time before it was more shops and stores this time it's a lot of people from out of town a lot of you know people just bought a table and they've got a bunch of expensive stuff so be patient though um, there's a lot of overpriced stuff I think it was because of the first day um, don't blow your wad on the first day. Um, this this whole stack of stuff cost me $100 on the dots. So um, I went to different people, made negotiations, took my time. Um, be patient. That's all I'm going to say to y'all. Don't blow your wad. Um, these three, not big deals. Justin Jackson, Jacob Evans, Wesley Windu. I paid a dollar each for these. And the reason is they came in these nice... Uh, um, Things at these uh, top loaders, so you know the the, the uh, magnetic ones. I'm blanking on the name of them, but I'm gonna take these cards out of here and uh, yeah, I, I just for a dollar each. You know, you're gonna pay three dollars for a brand new one, so I'll just buy these and put my other stuff in here. I got a Jared Allen um, rookie Dominion for three dollars. Now this was part of a deal that I paid uh, fifty bucks for all of the cards I'm about to show you, so. The price isn't really accurate because it's going to add up. So we're already at three. This is now six. Got that. We got a Nurkic red, um, yellow, blank, <laughs> prism, red, white, blue. Uh, I don't even know what you call it. Seven dollars. I like him a lot as a card to send into grade. And being on the Blazers with Lillard is a good help as always. Jalen Brown rookie threads. Got this one, I figured it'd be an easy flip. I don't know comps online, but buying as a package deal was nice. I got DeAndre Jordan, rookie, um, Bowman, $2. I don't know comps again, but being on the nets with KD, Kyrie, and Harden, they're my pick to win the NBA Finals. This should go up. We've got a Jonathan Isaac Optic for $2. Not terrible. Um, I like Jonathan Isaac a lot to come back from his ACL. And this was all throw in, so, oh, whoops. We're skipping ahead here. Um, let me just make sure I'm not leaving. Oh, I am leaving some stuff out. I'll get to it in a minute. I got a whole stack of Jalen uh, Marcus Smart um, stuff. $8 for his prism. We paid, uh, we got five of his selects. Um, they were listed at $6 each. It's about what comps are online. So that was a nice pickup, and let me, uh, pull out here the other cards that are part of this deal really quick for y'all 
also part of this $50 deal came with, one second here, it also came with John Collins Select for $4, the uh, concourse, not bad. Um, and I got a Josh Jackson scope. He's been playing very well this year in Detroit. I might grade this, depending on how clean it is. I like him a lot as a rebound player. And I got this Pascal Siakam Donners for five bucks. Not bad, um, considering it was 30 last NBA Finals. So overall, these cards listed three, eight, 16, 20, 26, uh, 32, 38, 44, 50, 58, 60, 62, uh, 66, uh, 73, 76. So I got $76 worth of stuff for 50. Can't go wrong with that. Um, and I'm gonna flip some of it and make some money on that, grade some of it and do my thing. So next up is my soccer stuff. Um, I'm big into soccer. I'm telling you all this. Um, all of this was $10 total, a little more than I wanted to pay, but this guy is legit. It's Frankie De Jong. Um, pretty clean sticker. I have to look a little closer at it, but I got his FIFA 365 here. Might grade that one. I got three of the same one right here. It's him next to Carlos Elena. Um, just cool alternate, different types of photos. Um, can't go wrong with those. I got a De Jong. Next to Rakitic and uh, Busquets, Legends at Barcelona. These are cool variations. And I got this uh, 365 one here as well. So just different different variations. I don't know the values, but they've gotta be close. The first one I showed you guys, this one alone is worth like $20, I believe, online. So I'm definitely gonna go back and try and pick up more stickers from those guys, because um, I think they're underpriced compared to online. So next up, I paid a dollar for both of these total. Um, I got a Michael Strahan rookie. Just thought it was kind of cool, especially now that he's on TV a lot, right? Um, public figure, uh, very well known. We'll have to see how clean it is. Might be worth grading, maybe not. And I got this uh, Disney card thrown in. I don't really know what this is, <laughs> um, but it's like a Skybox um, card. Just thought it was cool, rare. Maybe not, but I uh, have no idea. But 50 cents, I'll try it. I paid $3 total for these. They did a half off. So, you know, I bought two of them, you know, Drummond cards. I don't know if they're his, yeah, they're his rookies. So, um, might grade them, might not. Um, we'll see. $3, can't go wrong. Again, guys, I paid $100 for all these cards from the show. This stuff is different, but $100 for all of this. And now is the fun part. At the end of the day, I found this place. I'm, those are, those y'all going to the car show, I'm not telling you where they are. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's too good of stuff. But they essentially had here um, car, a great dollar box. So all these cars were a dollar. So let's hop into them. We've got a Mitchell Robinson Optic Shock for one dollar. Nicholas Claxton for a dollar. Rui Hechimera um, with the Wizards, uh, Yellow Flux. I don't know who this is, but a Green Pulsar Auto Ross Blacklock. Why not? Got uh, two Mo Bombas, a dollar each. Um, a little off, actually they are off center, top to bottom, the where I look at them, so we'll just sell those. Michael P. Ryan, red, white, and blue. Donovan Peoples Jones, red, white, and blue. Joshua Kelly, I just had to put these in sleeves. I had uh, red, white, and blue. These are not part of this, sorry. Some of my stuff got mixed up. Uh, Jordan Alvarez, uh, Bowman rookie. Terrell Lewis, again, I, I figure an auto, green pulsar. It has to be worth at least a dollar. Jake Lutton, number 149, never know. Um, they had a Lucas Sandwich silver hoops. DeAndre Hunter, uh, Green Hoops, Lynn Bowden, Orange Disco, Jalen Rager, Red, White, and Blue, Michael Pittman, Prism, 
I just sold one of these for three dollars online. So, um, and a Lucas sandwich prism base for a dollar. And again, guys, are these going to be worth fifty dollars? No. But can I grade some and make them fifty dollars, or can I sell some to get my money back? Of course I can. Like these Mo Bombas should be worth a few bucks. Um, you know, this is worth three. So it's the little things, it's the little turning a dollar into five to get it going, right? You gotta have that little base of cards um, constantly going through to, you know, keep flipping, keep making money while you wait um, for cards to return from grading, right? To support you grading, um, to do all that stuff. And let me, one second, grab. I got two other cards that I forgot to show that now I've got a try and find oh yes here's one and here's the other so early in the show it like I got there right at time right at two these were not supposed to be out there I don't believe because I got this cam reddish scope select rookie for ten dollars amazing deal in my opinion I believe I looked at comps I think it was like 20 30 but I could be wrong um very least I might grade this because it looks clean um depending on centering. And I got this uh, Kevin Porter orange laser uh, rated rookie. So clean card, centered, very nice. And this one was funny because this was $10. And and as soon as I grabbed it, I was like, okay, man, yeah, I'll buy this one. The guy was like, uh-oh. <laughs> uh, all right. <laughs> I don't think he wanted to sell it for 10, but you know, that's why you get there early. And this was worth the price of admission. So um, yeah, so I appreciate you watching. You made it this far. This was the pickup from Friday. I'm going to go through it tonight and see what's worth keeping, grading, or selling. Um, you know, basically really selling or grading. That's the two things that we're doing here. But um, I just want to go back through it and, uh, you know, this is this is what you guys can do. I, I just For those of you who are new, those of you that don't know what to do, you don't have much money, if you have $100, or really 110 right, so you can get in, this is what you can do with $100. You just got to be patient, look around, be smart, negotiate, talk, open your mouth, and make negotiations um you can make it happen you can do it um so i'll be there tomorrow i'll be there sunday still working deals um i really don't have a limit on how much i'm going to try and spend um, i'm just going to be very very patient and try to work the deals so i appreciate you watching if you made it this far and i'll see you on the next one i'll see y'all uh, tomorrow so we'll see what kind of pickups and movement we made so i'll see y'all peace